Hey man, how y'all doing, uh, chosen ones and um, followers of Jesus Christ? Uh, I'm just coming to let y'all know, man. Um, you know, first of all, how y'all day going, man? I hope y'all day going good, man. Leave it in the comments. Uh, if y'all don't have people to check up on y'all or something, just put it in the comments, man. Um, um, just saying, if y'all don't have people to check up on y'all and stuff like that. But yeah, man, uh, put it in the comments how you doing. I hope y'all having a great day. I hope y'all doing well today. I hope everything's going good for y'all. And um. Yeah, I just want to let y'all know, man, uh, uh, demons can preach too. Um, just how just how I can stand on this phone, right, um, and tell you what to do, what to do, and, and what not to do in order to get in the kingdom of heaven. It's people that will do this, sit on this phone, and they will tell you that you're doing everything wrong. But in reality, in reality, they're not even following Christ. In reality, they're not even doing nothing that helps the kingdom of God. They're just putting out the message, but they're not doing the works. God said, be not a hearer, but be also a doer. So so if you're out here spreading the word, okay, that's good. But are you doing it? Are you doing the work? Are you actually putting in the work? See what I'm saying? Are you actually putting in the work, bro? Are you actually putting in the work? See what I'm saying? Um, uh, uh, say thing you make a video talking about, oh yeah, you shouldn't smoke weed because it opened doors for demons and stuff like that. Okay. Uh, the carnal Christian, the, the lukewarm Christian, they gonna go smoke a blunt right after they did that video. They gonna go smoke a blunt right after that. They gonna call the weed man up. They say twin, blame me a little three five. Shit, I need to get me a little hit in. That what they'll do, bro. See what I'm saying? That's exactly what they'll do to you. Um, but yeah, man, you can't trust everybody who won't hear preaching, man. You gotta, you gotta trust yourself, bro. Cause it's World War III. You know what I'm saying? So you can't trust nobody now, because um, after CERN opened that portal uh, in February, uh, I noticed, bro. It's like everybody been weird. Like everybody been feeding on my energy type shit. Like everything been weird ever since. Um, because y'all don't know, after CERN opened that portal. After CERN opened that portal, bro, it's like it, it's like all the demons came, bro. Like they, like people who didn't believe in Christ and people that were smoking weed and stuff. Hey, I remember when I was smoking weed, watching porn. I, I felt like I had a demon on on me. Like I would feed off other people's energy. I would love to be around people. I I always be on the phone with people feeding off their energy, stuff like that. I just always be on the phone with them. They, it was a demon on me, bro. It was a demon attacking me. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 but you gotta cut off all ties to demons, close all doors to demons, man. Um, yeah, man, don't trust nobody because the uh, demons can preach too. Um, uh, you know how God said Satan came as an angel of light, Satan comes as an angel of light. So he's a side, um, he disguises himself as an angel of light. Um, when I was in college, right, and so this man. Um, this when I first started following Christ. I was like 20 days in. Uh, uh, I was on semen retention for 20 days. Uh, um, I'm on it for two months now, but uh, sucker been been attacked me like five times, but I, nah, I never let it do it again. But yeah, uh, nah, nah, never mind. I think it was like 10, but yeah. Uh, 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 moral of the story, bro, he was a, Sam, he was just a false prophet. He was trying to bring me down. He, he was an agent for Satan. All, to, all trying to lure me back in. Like, I was with him. Um, uh, um, I was walking down the street one night. After he was right there. I was, I was like, what's up, bro? You good? What's up, brother in Christ? He just looked me up and down. He was sitting right down next to some girls. He had just looked me up and down. So I'm like, oh, yeah. This means I can't trust nobody. No matter the circumstance. You know what I'm saying? You can't trust nobody, bro. Because um, it's spiritual warfare, World War Three. Yeah, spiritual warfare, World War Three. Um, Yeah. Yeah, y'all must know, man. Demons can preach too. Demons can preach too. You must know that. Just because they can get on this phone and say, Hallelujah, praise the Lord. Jesus is king. And they can say all that. And, and they can say all that, bro. They can say all that, but are they really a follower for Christ? See what I'm saying? Are they really a follower for Christ? Moral of the story, trust yourself. Read your own Bible. You don't have to go to church because... Um, because the church been gone, man. Everybody in church are lukewarm Christians. Everybody in church are, are everybody in church is saying one save, always save. Um, yeah, man, that's what they're saying. But no, nah, that's not. That, 
uh, that's not how it go, bro. You gotta um, faith without uh, faith without works is dead. You see what I'm saying? Faith without works is dead. So that's how you gotta do it, man. Faith without works is dead. Don't be a lukewarm Christian. And also remember, um, demons can preach too. So so don't trust nobody in today's time.